So good morning. It is Vlogmas day 11 and we have exciting plans tonight. So I'm heading off to work. Very excited. Tonight our plan is to go to Galaxy Lights at Space Center Houston. It's the first year they're ever doing it. It looks super neat. Christmas lights all over NASA. Very excited for it. So I have to go finish work so we can go on an adventure. All right. Day 11. And for Harry Potter, we have, oh, <laughs> fitting. There's Parvati. Do you say Parvati or Parvati? Hmm. I have to say that these two figures are just absolutely beautiful. The detail on them are just so, so pretty. Very neat addition to the collection from last year. And I absolutely love them. So I kind of have everyone in pairs at the moment. Floor is the only one without a pair. But otherwise, everyone's just kind of laying down with their friend. <laughs> and uh, waiting for their date to arrive. I guess Harry's date is here, but for now I've still got him with Jenny. Good morning, handsome. How are you? How are you with those ears? How are you doing with those ears? All right, I'm off to work, but here's a little chat from doing my makeup this morning, which is my new favorite thing. So good morning, everyone. It's time for another makeup chat. <laughs> I've realized this works out really well from a multitasking standpoint, where I can have my little morning chat with you guys but also be getting ready for work, so I'm not uh, wasting too much time vlogging before work. So today I want to talk to you about my schedule for the upcoming week because we have officially entered into the busiest week of the year for me. <laughs> so my work is a little strange where our weeks run from Wednesday to Tuesday. So yesterday was the last day of my week and today is the first day of my week. And this week from Wednesday to Tuesday is going to be massively busy. So I'm working every day except for Monday in this pay period week of Wednesday to Tuesday. And because of that, it is currently 11.47 and I'm finishing getting ready for work because today's going to be a really short day. But the reason today is a very short day is because tomorrow's going to be a really, really long day. I'm going to use the original Naked palette today. So I'm working six hours today, maybe a little less. But that's because tomorrow's going to be an 11 or 12 hour day. That meant today I could take it easy. I slept in, which was great. It was very much needed on the 11th day of Vlogmas to get a little extra sleep to catch up from the first 10 days of staying up way too late editing these videos. So I'm definitely grateful. But that's just the reality of Vlogmas. It's a labor of love and I do lose sleep. But in the end, I love going back and watching the vlogs because it's kind of a blur as it goes by. Like you just edit and cruise through life so quickly because there's so much going on that I don't really get to take the time to appreciate the videos until after Vlogmas is over. But as I've been going back and linking old Vlogmas videos as I'm talking about them, I'm watching them again and being like, oh, I love these. But it's nice to have once Christmas and Vlogmas is over for me to be able to go back and watch what we did this whole season that went by in a blur as it always does. So with that, I'm off to work. I will see you guys afterwards for Galaxy Light. Our Shutterfly package arrived today and I thought it was going to be our Christmas cards, but it was actually our ornament. So get a little preview of another engagement picture there. It is a good one. And that one on the back. We cute. So that's our, our new ornament. Bean wants to see it. Here, do you approve? Do you approve? Home from work and I've changed into my warm clothes for a night out at NASA. I'm so excited and I love this sweater. There's the new ornament on the tree. So before we go, I figured I'd answer a question from the hat but I will admit I cheated. I found a short one. So I'm answering a short one for tonight. So tonight's question is from Valerie and she says, we know how much Spaceship Earth means to you. 
what is or was your second most favorite ride or attraction at Epcot? So if we're thinking of all time at Epcot, obviously Spaceship Earth is number one. In past times, it would have been Imagination, the original Imagination ride. I absolutely loved it. I fell in love with Figment at an early age. I just loved that attraction. But these days, without the original Imagination, without Maelstrom, I would say my second favorite attraction is actually Living with the Land because it still has that mostly original Epcot vibe to it. Ash is angry about something. <laughs> and it still feels the most Epcot of what's there. So those are my favorites. We are here. I see lights. Oh yeah. Off to a good start here. I like it. I like it. Very nice. So, since it's the first year of them doing this, we really had no idea what to expect as far as crowds, but I feel like there's like five other cars over there. No, there's one that there over on that side, but. I mean, I'm used to seeing this like on it, a normal it's day. Not, it's not packed by any stretch. Yeah, I'm used to seeing normal. Space Center Houston traffic and very light in here compared to a normal day. That's what we were hoping for. We chose a weekday on purpose. It's not more what you like. It's not. It's not empty, but it's definitely, we've been here on a busier day just in general visiting, so that's exciting. And it worked out. It's a nice chilly night. Pretty excited about that. Ready to see some new Christmas lights in Houston. So pretty! What a pretty tree. So I don't know where to go or what to start with, but this is definitely much quieter than we're used to for a normal day, so I'm very excited. We're out to catch our tram. All the zigzags here. <laughs> okay, we're out on the tram. We are waiting. Are you so ready? Thumbnail now. <laughs> You're welcome. The hood on this jacket might be a little <laughs> unnecessarily large. Yeah. Nice in their camo back here. You can't see it. I don't need to actually see anything on this tour. And we're off. Yeah. <laughs>
where we're headed. Rocket Park. So cool. So we're heading into the Saturn V building. Checking this out first. So they're doing a projection on the Saturn V rocket, which don't know if you can tell, but it's massive. It's huge. section seems to have its own little story happening here. He's got a little robo dog. He's so cute. I'm out of place in the sea full of smiles Walking down Main Street tonight Got a lot on my mind since you walked out and said Merry Christmas, babe, give me some time Holidays are coming and there's no way around uh, He's still fetching <laughs> Cute Backside has a bunch of squiggles what are you so mad about? Oh, are there infected. inaccuracies? Oh no! Space infected! No! Got some, some Martian germs here. That's what everyone's always concerned about, Martian germs. It's time for Christmas And Christmas is my favorite time of year It's beginning to look like all my wishes Are coming true, that's why I cheer If you've never been to Kennedy Space Center or here to just field. see, yeah, it's a football field You've never been here to see the scale of it. It's so crazy, so impressive. With that, I think it's time to head out to the rocket park and see everything else out there. It's so pretty out here. I'm telling you, we need to find somewhere that'll do custom lights for us and we just have a whole space-themed Christmas display. I think what we need to do. Okay. I know Mike's on board. <laughs> All right. Time to take a bunch of pictures together with the Christmas lights, your favorite thing. You love me, right? <laughs> Time to force him to take some pictures with me. I've been busy decking the halls. I've been kind to big and small. And now it's time to have a merry holiday. What a feeling when it's time for Christmas. Let's sing a So is this a satellite or is it supposed to be the space station in miniature? Space station. Okay. Space station it is. We've got some astronauts and some planets. This is a really cute addition and very Houston specific. Although I think Kennedy Space Center should do this too. I think it's time for us to catch a tram and head back, but this is super cute. Ready to go for a stroll through the rocket? Mm -hmm. Here we go. Whee! Oh, cute! I didn't even realize. That's so cute. What a nice little detail. <laughs> Oh, 
So neat. Head it, head it back into the center. It's gonna be a cold ride because it's cold right out here. So, the Statue of Liberty, and it's 6.5 million pounds. This tram is a little bumpier than our first one. You can see more, but it's bumpier. And now we're at the shuttle. We're back inside. You know what? Oh, they've got a block job. I was like, you know what? I've never made it in there without having 5,000 other people in there. And womp womp. Today, I will still not make it in there without a thousand people in it with me. <laughs> Clearly they're like, get out. <laughs> But look, here's more moon steps. This is fun. <laughs> Easily amused, okay? Best themed photo booth I've ever seen. It's one of those like take yourself photo booths, but it <laughs> so cute. Best theming award right there. So we got a super cute souvenir photo to remember tonight. And now we're gonna explore this middle section. A lot of interactive goodies. Are you breaking things? <laughs> See how it Nope. Shows like the difference in force. The force? You want to do that one? No. You do it. Demonstrate. end at the gift store. See if we can find any cool nasty gifts. <gasps> I love that shirt. Oh my gosh. I love it. Oh, they have the t-shirt version too. Oh, that's happening. Oh my gosh, I love all of these. This is gonna be a struggle. I definitely want a Christmas NASA shirt. And a green version. Oh. Yep, that's happening. We started shopping, but now this light show is happening out here. It's really cool. Wow, a little sandstorm. Taking it back to 2000 here. <laughs> We've entered the club. Such Christmas now. Oh, it's a candy cane. And a Christmas tree. <laughs> There's a whole Disney section. <laughs> it's kids, obviously. But then also, here's my section. All my aliens. I believe. Okay, goodbye. Space Center Houston, we had a really nice time. Perfect weather, really cute. Pretty much had the place to ourselves. A plus. So 
we're home. Let's go ahead and do the Sugar Fina calendar and then I'm gonna sign off for the night. So, let's see, day 11. We're looking at, ooh, is it back to a gummy? Oh, yes, mini cola cuties. These gummy cola bottles have a crisp, refreshing taste with just the right amount of sweetness. I love these. If you can't tell, I'm more of a gummy candy person than a chocolate candy person. So what are you? Are you a gummy candy person or a chocolate candy person? So we had a ton of fun at the Galaxy Lights, but now I need to sign off, edit this, and go to bed. So I will see you guys again tomorrow for day 12. Bye!